Good morning, Facebook fam. Um, I know they, I have a couple of my highly anticipated Fortis fans just, just waiting for this moment this morning. Um, so yesterday's match featured Kingston College and Camperdown. Um, so Houston, we have we have a small problem here. We think 2020 any year for PG against Shim. Big time. No, but no, it's like KC was gonna win the match. That, that, that was no surprise. But my god, we can't make them work feet. Can't put on you couldn't make them just work feet. Make them make them make them go hard, you know. Make them do, do. Last year at the same time, the build up towards the quarterfinals and the semi-final, then it did so tense, it did so, you know, it was invigorating. Cause you, you, you're just fully anticipating, you know, who, who are got, you, you just never know. Because the competition was so stiff, it was so intense. This year, me, me, me tell them, say, wait till bigger badder, dopey, but KC. Right you now, a beer puppy, and a dopey, a puppy, a player. With with KSC, right? From and they're the most consistent thing. That's that's the thing where really I forget the man them credit. The first match with, with, with Green Pan, I think I must say 49 them score. Then them buck Meadowbrook a 50, 51. And then last night, who a 52? Lord Camper and then Camper down, them just Camper down was playing against themselves last night. Don't know KSC them did that play. Be shame. Be shame. Camper down. And them say wrong and strong last night. And them, them not stop slap up the buzzer in the, the, the section and a pure foolishness. Pure foolishness that matter. So the score ended on Kingston College on a solid 52. And Camper down on 13. One, three. So 52. Divided by 13 equals 4. 4. So, Gaston, might as well, you tell me where you want to eat. Because the only other school, let me see, can really take them on right now. I'm adding. I'm going to know what I'm going to do, but that's the only anticipated match I hope to see. 